She is. I mean, Stella is a boss lady. She is already has a business at seven years old and has been making some fabulous, tasty cookies for a couple months now. Stella, talk to me about what your bake shop is. You have like four kinds of cookies, right? Mm-hmm. So you want to tell me which ones we have this morning? We have chocolate chip today, we have oatmeal chocolate chip, and we have our sugar this morning. Okay, and I'm looking at these really cute little menu cards. How did you decide that, you know, you were going to go with the color pink, and how'd you get labels, all that kind of stuff? Well, I mean, I really like the color pink, and I thought it would look good with the boxes and mm -hmm. the cookies. And I just really like it. I love it, and... You I'm like to bake cookies, it. yeah. Yes, and so you've been doing it for a couple months now. Do you have a goal for Stella Bella's Bake Shop? you have a business goal in mind? I really like horses, so I might get a horse. So you, okay, you want to save up some money to buy a horse. What kind of horse? I really like Clydesdales. <laughs> Where are you going to put a Clydesdale? I have no idea yet. But you have been thinking about this for a while. You even know what you would name your Clydesdale. Yes, his name would be Larry. So, okay, how many cookies do you think you'll have to sell to afford a Clydesdale? I bet 2000 well, no, probably more than that. We might have to bump up the prices, right? Yes. <laughs> but first, we're going to try these cookies. What's your favorite cookie? Oatmeal chocolate chip. So that's this one. So, okay, so you pick yours, and I'll pick mine. So which one should I get? This one right here, maybe? Yeah. You said that the oatmeal chocolate chip is a good one for breakfast. Mm -hmm. Why do you think so? Because it has oatmeal in it. Uh-huh. I think they're really good. Mm. That is really good, Stella. You were picking out the perfect chocolate chip cookie, too. Which one is, was perfect to you? This one. Why is that? It looks gooey and buttery. Gooey and buttery? Okay, that's pretty cool. How should people make orders if they want to buy some Stella Bella cookies? Um... On the cards, we have our Instagram. Okay. And everything else, all the information you need. That's awesome. I heard that you came up with a business plan, and you were going to do like something kind of like Target pickup. Mm -hmm. you, so you could just bring cookies out to people who come to your driveway, that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. How long did you think about that business plan before your mom said yes? Mm, maybe a couple weeks Yeah. Or so. How'd you finally convince her? Mm. Did you bribe her? No. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't bribe her? Mm-mm. But um, we went to the children, the Indianapolis Children's Museum, mm -hmm. and uh, there was a new Barbie exhibit, and there was something called the Dream Gap. So we watched the video, and it was a, it was a, at the age of five where girls stopped believing they, they could be what they wanted to be. Mm -hmm. So my mom finally said yes, because she thought, well, I don't want to keep her waiting, so... And do you think that you're living your dream right now, starting a bake shop? Mm-hmm. I do, too. That's pretty cool. You can head over to Stella Bella's Bake Shop Instagram or on Facebook. Place an order through DMs. She's already getting lots of followers, guys. And these cookies are really good. That gave me goosebumps. I know, That was right? really sweet. Yeah. I think she might be onto something with that delivery there, too, Alex. Really clever. <laughs> By the way, I just looked it up. The mm -hmm. most expensive Clydesdale ever sold, $212,000. <laughs> a lot of cookies. She's going to have to sell. Bad news, $212,000 for a Clydesdale. I mean, it's well, that not was the most expensive. White thoroughbred. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> She's not even balking at that. She's like, She's all like, right, I got this. You can it. do it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Matt, rough weather out there this morning, just put huh? put that Clydesdale right out in the backyard.